Okay guys, in this video, I will be replacing the Traxxas X Max per gear holder and the bearings in the shaft on the spur gear. So subscribe, stay tuned. Removing the body on the Traxxas X Max. So the stock spur gear holder there, as you can see, it's a plastic, which is stupid by Traxxas. So for this, I'm going to remove the cover first, the spur gear cover with 2.5 millimeter. This is the 8 cell version and after owning the X-Max for a long time now it's time to change it because I tried many do-it-yourself fixes which was a trash what happened is when it's overheating the bearing size or the bearing jams and after that you will make this cover where the bearing sits much bigger and you will have your spur gear plane what is wrong with the traxxas and everybody should agree with me in front of your spur gear in this place exactly there is a place where i think they misdesigned that so there should be a bearing in this place and your shaft should sit in here on the chassis as well not only from one side if the traxxas will do some upgrades which I don't think so because so many times people complaining about the spur gear on the X-Max and this is the reason your shaft and spur gear are sitting only from one side which is this side the holder side which I'm going to replace now because it's damaged on my case here is the cover I'll show you what happened to it on this side here you can see this hole look this is where the bearing sits cheap aliexpress part and it's aluminium so this will be the replacement of this part over here matching the same size and dimensions and the holes all are the same and your bearing will sit properly in here it will not play like in this case this is very important thing to change when you have an X-Max So this bearing over here, I'll be replacing it and this bearing as well. I'll replace both with the fast eddy bearings for the X-Max. Good stuff. Actually the best. So I will open this. So insert the bearing like this on your shaft. Spinning nice, dude. Then attach your back gear cover and then your pen, let it sit in place and put back in the cover. In my situation, I have this plastic cover also, so it will not play sitting in place so here we go don't 
don't over tight the plastic never on any RC you have here we go no play at all and here is no play at all it's sitting nice and clean then you can put back in your gear and the other bearing from this side keep holding the gear and the pinion so they will not fall from your hand so you will not have more damaged gears let me set the cover correctly yes it's so nice checking the gear this is what I want exactly that's it for this video guys hope you like it don't forget to subscribe to the channel it will help me a lot to stay coming with these videos see you in the next one